Okay, guys. Well, this game is going to be the only one from the series, I think, that's going to be very one matchup oriented. And here it's about the Nessus matchup. Why do I make a video about the Nessus matchup? Because it's one of the biggest counters to Trindamir. And in higher elos, it's very rarely picked. But in lower elos, I know that it's picked a lot. It actually used to be my one trick before, uh, before Trindamir. So I'm going to show you how I deal with Nessus and how I make the best of that losing matchup. Especially through my runes. I take Cleanse plus Ghost into this matchup. Matters a lot and I think that I will permanently do the same also into Timo and that's about it. And then you'll see how I play the early game, the mid game and then how I play the map later because at some point you lose side lane even if Nessus is 0 and 10 and you're 10 and 0. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Much love. <laughs> Okay guys, hope everyone is doing well. We're still playing on the Unring to Master series. We're in Plat 3, Plat 1, Plat 2, Plat 3, Plat 1, Plat 1, Plat 2. Okay, we're in Plat 2 MMR. And we're facing Nasus. So let's see, what do we have here? Um, Smolder, Tam Kench. I've changed my opinion on Smolder. I used to think that it's only good with like peeling supports. But Smolder is so strong at ATM that's just good with anything basically. Um, into Samira Blitz, okay, okay, Samira Blitz, I like that. Well, bot lane needs to snowball absolutely, and if they manage to get a couple kills, it's gonna be so, so strong. So, play for bot, play for bot, play for bot, that's it. Nothing else, play, play for bot. Okay, mid lane is Orianna versus Karma, Karma is turbo OP, um, but Orianna is pretty strong as well, I think it's gonna be kinda stalemate uh, mid lane, and they're gonna scale up, and... They will try to have impact. Karma with uh, Mentra Qs. Oriana with big ults. Uh, Oriana can hit ults pretty easily because it's melee, melee, uh, melee, and then mid range. And Karma as well. So we'll see. It's gonna, like, the, the, the power of mid lane is going to come down to team fights. Who has the prior though? Um, I think it might depend on who uses their abilities the best, basically. Viego into Ramus. Well, Ramus is it good here? AD, 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 and then the AP damage dealers don't deal that much. I mean, I guess Karma does. But, but yeah, it's it's pretty good, Ramus, I think. Uh, and also he has gank potential on bot lane. I don't like that he's starting bot. And on top lane. So I'm going cleanse into Nasus, and well, you will see why. Because Nasus is a true counter to Trent. And the reason Nasus is a counter to Trend is because of his W. So if you can cleanse the W, well, Nasus is not anymore a counter to Trend. I'm just making sure that I'm denying the, free, the first three CS of XP while getting them myself. Now we can start playing the lane normally. Also, I took a big trade. I was thinking about... Uh, often, uh, junglers don't want to path towards a Nasus. So what they do is they ask him to leash the path away from him and maybe you can punish from level one just the fact that they're leashing now i don't want nessus to have a wave pushing to him forever that's what nessus likes having a wave frozen so now i'm gonna crush it here and on the bounce back look to kill the guy Let's see, how do we get... Something that can, I can do here is actually base. Buy something. Because yeah, like the wave is just like pushing back to me. I don't have I don't have much to do. Um, I, I don't want to go... Like I was thinking about setting my pot and going cool. But you want to go cool only if you want to scale. And I don't want to scale into Nasus because he wins the scaling war. I want to snowball on him. So I'm just going to go for a long sword. And... Oh, I actually missed three melees. Well, my wave was not perfectly crashed then. And now the wave is pushing to me. And I have an item advantage. And I have my, my ghost and cleanse. Come top after. Scuttle. Three. Kill. Okay, never mind. Okay, 
Okay, still. I am your worst nightmare. Come, 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 come. I mean, I can kill him by myself. I didn't even need to cleanse here, but I just cleanse so you understand like the, <laughs> just so you understand like how strong it is. Like okay, you're Wing me. Well, I just I just cleanse. No 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 no, gank. Oh, he showed. The idea was that. Yeah, this is gonna come back. And the wave is still bad for him. And we can look to kill him again. Okay. He's dead if he walks up because boss advantage. With all the lethal tempo, he's dead 100%. With the new one, he's dead, but I die as well. It's fine though. It's fine because my wave is good. Okay, it's actually not. Shit, shit, shit. Bro, lethal tempo nerves, come on. So bad. I would get more autos, so I would, I would reset my E earlier. Also, I could have maybe lived if I kept walking and auto E the way, but because he got another W, because I was slowed, maybe I couldn't do that. Okay, so now there's a big wave crashing. Um, I need to use that to get something. I think what I will get is well, the demolish proc. Was not supposed to take two turret shots here. Kinda messed up, I could have killed Viego and ran away. I'm level 6 to 2 level 5, so I knew that I could fight that. Uh yeah, I think I didn't have to E that way. It's okay though. What I don't like is that Nazus is getting resources. I mean, he only has like 27 CS at 7 minutes, but still. He's getting gold, he's gonna buy armor. And it's gonna get tougher and tougher to kill him. But the wave is really good though. Didn't manage to crash it. And I have cleanse in 25 seconds, so I think we're in a really good spot now. He's not gonna be able to. Fix this. So I kind of want to make him use W once. Don't want to use E because if I E, he can actually like ult W. That's why I like to go cleanse into Nessus. Now, because I have Noon Quiver, I actually push waves really fast. Because it's only like E plus auto to, uh, to kill a caster. And I will use that. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, yeah, it's true. He didn't TP. Mm. It's fine, though. There's different ways to have a good wave. You can crash it, but you can also have it pushed to you. So I'm seeing, is he actually pushing it? Mm. 
thinking that we can actually dive, maybe. Ramus. Or maybe it's not needed to have Kraken Slayer. Okay, I want base here out of vision. Yeah, tell me because he walked on the side. Uh, still, I'm basing now. I'm baiting Kraken Slayer. And now we have a ghost advantage. The only bad thing is because he can sell me base, he's gonna have the time to push that next wave and fix it. Now maybe because he's a Nasus player, he's gonna think, oh, wave equals stacks, and he's just gonna stack it. But I guess he's not being that stupid. Or is he? Or maybe he just doesn't have the push power because all he has is armor. So again, he is doomed. Nice. Uh, I don't need you. If he helps me, it means that we're just sharing golden XP. I don't want to share with Remus. Maybe if it was an Evelyn, a Rengar, I don't know, something that really like uses gold a lot, I would. Because it's Remus, I'd rather not. I wish we'd win that. Nice. Okay, pretty good. So, uh, into Nasus, you actually don't want to take the turret too early. Here, I could take T1, but that would be a mistake. Because then he can actually freeze the wave here. And then I cannot punish that. My bot is killing 1v2. Okay. Take those. So, I'm actually gonna keep that turret alive. Let's see what's the state of the game. Uh, Jenga doing good. Or really good. Mid lane doing really good. Being helped by the jungler. Uh, my bot lane doing good as well. Sorry. Okay, well I have clans now. So guess what's gonna happen. I'm just gonna cleanse a W. I guess I had to cleanse defensively. I guess I'm pretty strong also. Okay. Yeah, Viego is pretty weak. I have my Kraken plus some extra ED. Uh, I don't need Blitz help. See if he wants to come. I don't think that was the play. Shouldn't try to hook, should just try to cut his way. And and press E basically. It's okay. I guess I would take the T1 now. I should have probably waited for Blitz. But I'm gonna make sure that I deny plenty of CS. And then wait for this wave to walk up. 
with the temperature settings, so I knew where it was because I was looking at my own wave. Now, use the fact that my wave is pushed. Go for Herald. I'm still gonna take this plant because uh, there is a play going mid and they might look to contest me, so I wanna be full HP if that happens. Okay, well, I guess the enemy team came back, plus they got shut down, so we're actually probably close to even in gold. And I always need to be careful in Tunasus because he could be in 0 and 12, he's still gonna outscale me. That's just how the matchup goes. I uh, have the gold for Rageblade, I think I would buy that. I don't really care about that second rake. I mean, I could, but I really don't want to let Nasus uh, free scale on a side lane yet. So I'd rather let my team in a 4v4 situation or to kill Nasus while I still can. Threaten to take T2, which is a lot of gold. And then move. So let's see, he base. There is a chance he's going to look to play on Drake. I'm just gonna deny those CS and then push. Make sure that I punish. If he moves, if he doesn't. I might actually move. Okay. We young that. I'm gonna put that down before. Okay, I'm gonna ignore the fight. I think getting two turrets here. Probably better. That's one turret. That's gonna be two because I have demolish. I think I want to use ult to, to kill her. I got what I wanted to. And I'd rather keep my resources for Nessus. I'm going to stack my Rage Blade first. Yeah, but this time you can try to hook, bro. Like, he didn't even Q? Well, at least it's Nessus Ghost. Yeah, Nessus has Frozen Heart. It's gonna get tougher. Me, but... He might look too Emi, but this time I can kill him, I think. I yeah, didn't have to, to, to ult. My bad. I was just like... Not exactly sure. Better save than sorry. If I give him the kill, if I give him the 1k shutdown, it's... Completely doomed. Now I see 3 mid. It could only be Viego. Uh, no, 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 no. They're all coming. Alright, his karma is... And I don't have ult. I have a 1k shut down. I'm gonna ping that. I have a lot of gold and no R. I'm not fighting this. They should fight me. Okay. Mountain rigs are really big because we really don't want Nasus to get them, but we really want Ramus to get them. Mountains are legit the best on Ramus. 
Okay, this time Ramus should come and play. Well, it's a bit sad that we didn't get Ramus. I guess he had gold to spend. We got the ghost on Smolder and Oriana gets T1. I need to make sure that I don't die. At least Oriana is pushing, you know, and we did push that wave. Yeah, Aryan is getting fed now. Or fed again, because she was fed. Just play Drake. Play Drake, wait, all, don't die. Okay, I got the ghost. Okay, I'm going for it. Uh, let's make sure. No, 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 no. Okay, we got it. I thought I would I would get what it's called. Get stunned by this. But I can't for nothing. Okay, go, go, go. Go, go. That was almost a 1v4 quadra. Ah, I can't for nothing. I thought that after you get ulted, like you insta get uh what it's called. I don't know if it's a stun or a root or whatever. Wait, I'm Kench. Oh we can look for Nasus, but then we need to base. Where do I want to be? Well, all T2s are taken. So I might just look to be on the side. I'm seeing that Karma is... Giga deep. Maybe I can look to punish. Resetting my E with Navari. Getting out of the range. W. Touch that. Okay, that's enough. I can look bot now. Wait. I really want to play the ways, but enemy team is giga overstepping all the time, so I think that's how we're going to win the game. We're just killing them. We have a wave coming. Oh 
we're not gonna end with that wave because they respawn in 20 so i would make sure that we get double inhibs stop just one Uh, Anesus has zero damage items. Anesus is supposed to have one damage items and then... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. He's 1v3-ing. Uh, and I give him my 1k shutdown. I guess Blitz hooked Nasus, which is well not the best idea in the world. On your Yen, I can deal damage to him. Wait, when did I see a mountain rig? There was no mountain rig. What? A Drake, Hextech Drake, Hextech. When did I see mountain? Hextech. Well, I'm crazy. Whatever. Um. What do I want last? Do I want to QSS on top of my cleanse? Do I want more damage? Do I want Borg? I think Borg is pretty good here. Ah, oh, they're fighting without me. I should have a return kit right now. Uh, I can look to kill Nasus. Okay. Two items Nasus, four items Trint. Who wins? It's actually gonna be closer than you expect. It's certainly gonna be closer if Diego is here. Okay, that should be enough for my team. But yeah, in, in the 1v1, this is, I think I cannot kill him actually. Where is Oriana? Oh, he's just so late. I mean, you're in 4v3. Now they're starting to blame each other. But I'm first kill. This, 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 fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Careful, careful, Lori. Okay. Pray for my team. I'm getting triple inhib. I 
messed up. I messed up by the way I used my E. I messed up by the way I used my E to go away from uh, what it's called. Karma E. Also, maybe I should have just uh, not went for the T4 and instead flanked the fight. Uh, it's okay though. No, we chilling. Wait all on the map. Punish. Weapon in it taken. Then no need to fight even. We just buff waves. I guess they can start it. Uh, Nasus has anathemas on me, so I don't win the 1v1 against Nasus anymore. 16 kills, full items, but I don't win the 1v1 versus Nasus. Because that's just how the champ is designed. So. That's not slow at all. It's the opposite of slow. It's fast. Okay, they're starting to dodge. We're getting there. Just waves buff. There will be forced to engage. But my team already lost so much HP for nothing. Smolder is enabled. Why are we not just buffing waves? Just waves buff, I said three times. Uh, let's play this with this. Well, at least it's open nexus. I guess it's gonna be back to our angle. He has four items now. Not not you by yourself, Samira. But what's he doing? I guess it's going for the back door, it's not gonna work, but at least we can kill Karma during that time. Just Samira don't die for this. Yeah, we get that. Okay, we get Vigo's flash. Maybe it's not worth to get his flash for Magos because Magos could be a really good threat on backdoor.
I'm concerned we're gonna be forced to team fight. But do we win team fights? Well, if we get a really good Oriana ult, if we get a uh, good Blitzhook, yes, maybe. If we don't. This guy, this guy. Why did I ult? Why did I ult exactly? I ulted. I'm so stupid. Yo, Samira, please go cancel, go cancel, go cancel. If I die for Karma Q, I'm gonna be so mad at myself. We got this, bro. It was so stressful, actually. It was so, so stressful. And we were stomping also. I'm not sure what happened, but it happened and, and we did our best. So yeah, Nice's matchup is pretty scary, guys. Not gonna lie. It's pretty scary. So you need to abuse early game. Cleanse is really good into this matchup. And then later on, like, you don't beat him anymore in 1v1, so... Don't try to beat him in 1v1s. You just play the side, try to bring him on side and, uh, and try to out-rotate on the map. And avoid him at all costs. You see that last fight, like we killed the Viego and then I was moving, pathing away from Nasus. Uh, because I was concerned about his anathemas and frozen heart and W's, etc, etc. Okay guys, well if you watched the video, thank you so much for watching it. Next video is going to be tomorrow, same time, same place. Until then, take care of yourselves guys, good luck and have fun game and in real life. And I will see you next time. Peace, much love.